The whole scary part about this is that we haven't even yet started flu season. The United States is averaging at least 55,000 new known COVID-19 cases per day. That's more than a 60% hike since mid-September. I'm extremely worried, and epidemiologists have been predicting a fall spike for a long time. As of Sunday, only two states, Missouri and Vermont, are showing at least a 10% drop in new cases. When you have people congregating en masse, not wearing masks, not doing physical distancing, barely using hand sanitizer, those are the perfect conditions in which you get the spread of the coronavirus from one person to another. Despite the increase in cases and deaths, Dr. Anthony Fauci, the top infectious disease expert in the nation, does not want to close down the country again. Put shutdown away and say, we're going to use public health measures to help us safely get to where we want to go. Some state leaders are pushing new restrictions while vaccine research and testing continues. Most Americans are going to be getting vaccinated in 2021, and we're probably looking at a March, April, if things go very well, time frame when, a, when a, let's say, a large proportion of American people uh, get access to vaccines. And here in the tri-state, New Jersey and Connecticut have reached the qualifications for their own travel restrictions. That calls for travelers from several states to self-quarantine for 14 days. 